how bread is made? It all starts with a farmer and his tractor. First, he has to plow the field to get rid of all the weeds so that wheat can grow. A plow is a machine that turns the dirt over and helps remove the weeds. It is attached to the farmer's tractor. Next comes the field cultivator. The farmer unfolds the machine like how you would open a book. It helps to smooth the freshly plowed dirt so it isn't bumpy when the farmer plants his wheat. The farmer puts the seeds of wheat into a machine called a drill press. It is attached to the farmer's tractor. He pulls it around the field and the wheat comes down a long tube into the ground. Then big metal wheels press the dirt over the seeds as the machine goes over the dirt. Thank <laughs> you. 
Do you see the wheat growing? How does it grow? It has to rain on the seeds and then the sun needs to shine and make it grow. Sometimes the farmer has to spray for weeds so that weeds can grow and not weeds. The wheat has to grow and turn a bright golden color. This means it is ready to be harvested. Now the farmer drives a really big machine called a combine. The combine cuts the wheat and separates the seed from the plant. When the combine is full of seeds, the farmer unloads it from the combine and puts it into a wagon. Then the wagon unloads it into a truck.
The farmer's helper drives the truck to an elevator. The elevator is where all the wheat is stored. The helper dumps the wheat into a giant pit, where a grain elevator takes it away for storage. When the elevator is full, the wheat is then loaded onto train cars. The train then travels to the bread factory.
workers at the factory unload the wheat and take it inside. Once inside, it is ground up into flour. Flour makes bread. Do you like bread? Now that the farmer is done, he has to unhook the machine from his tractor. The farmer is ready to go have some fun.